Motive. Means. Opportunity. If you eliminate any of these, you reduce your chances of being involved in a crime. Don't let this be you. Seventy-seven percent of women are sexually assaulted each year by someone they know, and alcohol is almost always involved. Young women between the ages of 16 and 23 report being sexually assaulted more than any other age group. Don't let this be you. Oh my god. What's wrong? Tell us what happened. started off like a dream. We were all drinking and dancing and having a great time. There was this guy. It was perfect until You can empower yourself and reduce the chances of being sexually assaulted. Here's how. Limit the amount of alcohol you drink. You can make some bad decisions when you're under the influence. Don't leave with someone you don't know well. Stay with the people you came with and that you know. Did he do something to you? I'm calling the police. No, it's my fault. I shouldn't have been drinking, and I shouldn't have gone to his house. We made out. I shouldn't have let it go that far. We can't call. Sexual assault is never your fault. If you think you may have been or are a victim, you are not to blame ever. If you have been or think you may have been sexually assaulted, report the assault to the police ASAP. Do not wait. Call 911 from a safe place. Do not eat shower, use the bathroom, or wash or change your clothes. This will allow police to gather valuable evidence. Medical staff must also collect evidence and perform a thorough physical exam to screen for injuries. This exam will assist in prosecuting the offender. Men are more likely to become sexually aggressive after they've been drinking. In fact, approximately 50% of all sexual assaults committed by men occur after they've been drinking. Before becoming intimate, get your partner's permission. Never assume you know what your partner wants. Even if she says yes earlier and then tells you to stop, you must stop, because no means no. Sexual assault is a crime. Don't let this be you. <laughs>